Holiday season bringing opportunities for parties and hosting loved ones this year to wow your guests. Just hire Kim Gallias. <laughs> you can do that. <laughs> Thanks, Daniel. Stuff appetizers. That's what we're going to get to. There's a lot of script in there, but we're just going to dive yeah, right into dive it because right you got in. some wonton creations over here and I told you I was like we got to get a cookbook done. I, I, I would love to do that. You are going to be my inspiration for 2024. All I'll right. say that. Okay but do you like crab meat? I love it all. Okay so cold crab meat salad. This is a no cook except you're going to cook those wonton wrappers and you're going to make these little cups. I don't know if the so camera can see them those. First? You cook these first. Okay. They just take like eight to nine minutes all and right. then you make your crab salad while they're cooking and my crab salad is full of celery and dill and parsley and red onions. It has nutrients and it's real fresh, yeah. but I have a surprise ingredient in my crab salad. What is that? Crystallized ginger for that Asian flair and it gives it's it sweet. some sweet. Yeah. yeah. And I love the canned Kroger lump uh, crab meat. That is going to be, uh, it, it's not cheap, but it's less expensive than the refrigerated lump crab meat. Okay. And it's a higher quality. Lump crab and meat And this is will be quality. easy to put together. You can put it in the refrigerator. And make it, uh, but don't make it too far in advance because those wonton cups will get totally soggy. soggy. There you so go. you want to fill them right before you serve. All right. Coming up next is some I told Andrew earlier, I grew up on pimento cheese. Okay, so I my love. pimento cheese is unique in that it actually has crumbled bacon oh. and toasted pecans, which are my absolute favorite. You're nut. jazzing up I, pimento oh, cheese. You got, you got to add some nutrients from those uh, pecans, you know, the yeah. heart healthy fats. But the thing is, it gives it a wonderful crunch and a toastiness. And I said, let's have a party with our pimento Why cheese. And let's do three things. And of course, the dietitian's pick would be the dates, the okay. stuffed dates. This is a no cook, quick thing. You make the pimento cheese in your mixer and then you keep it cold and you stuff those dates. That's all. You have three different appetizers but then, with pimento yeah, cheese. Yeah, here's what I did, Daniel. I said, I have got to use these pie crusts, these little mini ones. Yeah. I was so intrigued with them and I said, okay, let's cut them in half and make little tiny, tiny, tiny ones. I've stuffed them with that pimento cheese. You just bake those first for a few minutes as well. And it's just a great way to get the pimento cheese handheld. And then, okay, these are my empanadas stuffed with pimento cheese wow. and garnish with more pecans because I want you to have those nutrients. So having warm pimento cheese I've never had so I don't know how that would taste. Well it actually tastes really good like melted cheese because my pimento cheese is made with Monterey Jack cream cheese and lots of extra sharp cheddar. There you go. So it's going to be fabulous if you dates, like cheese. This is, this is jazz it up for sure. Yeah and I just wanted to say that the, the actual cups are this big that's why I cut them in half. Can you imagine how much Pimento cheese you'd get in that if you ate a full one. It's a big one. Okay. Let's talk final about the meatballs. These are these look good. These are what are going to give you protein to fill you up and keep you from just mindlessly munching on all kinds of stuff. They are made with extra lean ground beef, 90-10, only 10% fat. We can't forget their stuff with mozzarella. But they have mozzarella in them and you just cut these mozzarella sticks into little chunks and you push them in there and you close them up and you bake them and you serve them with marinara sauce because why, Daniel? Marinara sauce is a vegetable. Yes. And it has lycopene, which is especially important for all men for reducing risk risk of prostate cancer. That is for sure. Well, we love it when you come all the time, but especially during the holidays because you always jazz up the dishes and especially you did it again. You knocked Thank it out you. of the park with the appetizers. We really do appreciate it. For more information on Kim Galliaz's uh, recipes, you can just head to our website, fox59.com. You'll find everything there. And we promise you in 2024, we're going to get a, <laughs> we're going to get a cookbook. Okay, going. Daniel. All right, Jim, we'll say